What's up team DMS is the master stylist and I am back with another video. Today's video is a quick little um, partial quick weave. I guess you can call it a bow cut or whatever. Starting off using um, got to be got <laughs> lost my train of thought. Got to be a free spray just to um, uh, allow the cap to stick to the paper and then I'm still going to go back and sew the cap down because she does work out. So without me sewing the cap down, this would not last at all. So the hair that I'm using is Samra uh, Brazilian Ultra Meat Yaki in the number four. I believe this is a eight inch. And um, she wanted like blue and black, but her skin tone, she does not look good with black hair. And if you can see, I'm just kind of sectioning off right here because I'm doing like a peekaboo blue. So I'm a visual person. It's easier to just, you know, follow the lines. So I kind of just drew that on there so I know where to lay each um, blue track. And then I'm just going around and I'm going to stop right at where I want that blue to start. And then you just kind of piece in the blue end. So I stop right there on the end. I go back and I put another piece of blue there and then I go ahead and finish that same row off with the number four and I'm going to continue that until I get to the top. to the very very top piece I like to split that track so that it's thin and it lays down better um, so I just take a razor split that in half and then I'm gonna take um, one of those pieces and just put some um, just fill it up in the top and then that way it just lays much flatter than it would had I left the track the way it was Just for that very very last part I just take it and roll it and then just stick it down in there really hard kind of press in the middle spread it out comb and BAM there you go So now I'm just going to take my Tinkle uh, razor. You can get this razor uh, on Amazon or your local beauty supply store, any kind of little store. But um, if you can't, then get it from Amazon. I do have a link in my description box to my Amazon recommendations. And I'm um, just doing the top, uh, the front, I'm sorry, slightly longer than the sides, just so I'll have room to you know cut it and um, layer it and things like that and then if your client decides that they want it shorter then you can always go back but if you do it too short in the beginning then you're kind of stuck like that Team DMS. And then for this part, I'm just taking it and layering it all over so it's just not super, super flat. Um, so just giving it like, you know, 
some little razzle dazzle. So then I'm going to go ahead and start curling it. You can use, well, flat iron it. Any one inch flat iron of your choice. This one is, uh, I believe it's called by Hot Tool. I can't remember, but I got it from Sally's. It wasn't that much. It's not my favorite because it keeps um, the way that they have where you put your hand, it kind of keeps messing with the temperature. So if you're not paying attention, it goes back on 450. So that's the only complaint I have with this flat iron. Um, but it's inexpensive and it works. in and cleaning up the back I did have the back a little longer than I wanted it um, and just cleaning that up and um, taking a big two comb I got this comb at the Brown Brothers hair show thought it was pretty dope it's like really really spaced out um, but that's it that's our look for today this is what she's doing if you guys like this video y'all know what to do give it a thumbs up like comment subscribe ring that bell to be notified i love you guys so 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 very much and i'll see you again for the next video